Elon Musk is definitely making Twitter great again. In fact, he's probably making it great for the first time ever, but you know what I'm saying. Now, right here is a person that was employed by Twitter retweeting a quote or quote tweeting Elon and basically saying, hey, I've spent six years working on Twitter for Android and can say this is wrong. Talking about Elon's tweet apologizing for super slow in many countries. And then Elon says, then please correct me. What is the right number? Twitter is super slow on Android. What have you done to fix that? This guy responds, For a cold start of the app, there are 20 requests to load home timeline. Most of the requests are non-blocking and happen in the background. This includes things like images, user settings, hash flags, etc. Uh, I think there are three reasons the app is slow. First, it's bloated with features that get little usage. Second, we have accumulated years of tech debt as we have traded velocity and features over perf. Third, we spend a lot of time waiting for network requests responses uh maybe he should ask questions privately maybe using slack or email now that is where the problem happened right there and this person responds hey elon with this type of attitude you probably don't want this guy on your team he's fired holy shit he's fired yes hold these clowns accountable do not let them get away with this Holy shit, man. Elon is crushing it. The only reason I know about this story is because Jack Posobiec apparently retweeted to this tweet or uh, uh, responded to this tweet from Cernovich. Cernovich is another clown, by the way. Uh, absolute nut job. I can't stand Cernovich at all. Now, Cernovich has since deleted this tweet. Here's Jack Posobiec basically saying he called his boss a liar in public and then followed up with admitting he knew exactly what Elon was talking about and why. If he would have led with that, would have been made VP of the department. Now he's promoted to customer. I don't know what Cernovich said. I can read to or let me refresh. If I do get a screenshot of it, I will overlay it here, but I don't think I'm going to get one um, because I've looked. Fired via Twitter. What happened? That's the screenshot so that I just showed you. I want the Cernovich. Uh screenshots but i don't think we're gonna get it there's a bunch of uh, bots that elon's gonna have to clean up let's see anyone got a screenshot does not appear we got one yet dang it doesn't appear sorry about that if i can find one i will definitely uh i will definitely give that to you but yeah i love it man call cernovich out uh, I, I mean, I think Pasobic and Cernovich are cool. That's not really my point here. I don't like Cernovich at all. But I love what Elon is doing, holding these clowns accountable. You got to love it. Thank you so much, Elon, for continuing to be entertaining as hell on Twitter. Um, I don't care what happens with Twitter. If you grow Twitter, if you make it become this major success that it never was, that's great. If it destroys Twitter and it kills it, that's great too. Doesn't matter to me because I've never liked the platform. So if Elon can improve it, great. If he destroys it, great. I win either way, so it doesn't really matter. The fact that the blue check marks are crying their eyes out and they cannot seem to comprehend that regular people are in their mentions now. So funny. You have a safe space. It ain't Twitter anymore. Go find it. Have a great day. Thank you very much for checking out this video, and we will talk to you later.